Researchers discovered that two species of sea slugs, Alicia cf. marginata and Alicia atroviridis, can regrow their body after cutting off their own head, according to a study published Monday in Current Biology. Some animals like these Sacaglossin slugs, also known as sap-sucking sea slugs, can autotomize, which is when an animal sheds a body part voluntarily, said study author Sayaka Mito, doctoral student in the Department of Biological Sciences at Nara Women's University in Japan. She said the research team couldn't determine why the slugs shed vital body parts, but some animals do it to remove internal parasites that inhibit their reproduction, Mito said. Five of the 15 laboratory-bred young Alicia C.F. marginata slugs started to self-decapitate about 226 to 336 days after they hatched. They began feeding on algae within a few hours after losing their body parts and began to regenerate their heart within seven days. After 20 days, the slugs had regenerated their entire body. Three of the 82 Alicia atroviridis slugs decapitated their bodies at the neck. Of those slugs, two of them regenerated their bodies within a week. Not all the slugs were as lucky. Older slugs the Alicia C.F. marginata slugs who were hatched 480 to 520 days prior to self-decapitation did not feed and died within 10 days. It might seem like a silly choice for the older slugs to sever their head from the body if they won't survive, Mito said but the old ones will die soon anyway, and there may be a chance of surviving and regenerating a parasite-free body. Mito isn't sure how the slugs can live without some of their vital organs, but they can live without a heart probably because their heads are small and can intake oxygen from their body surface. One of the slugs in the experiment was able to complete the regeneration process twice, but Mito said she also is not sure how the slug could do it. More needs to be learned about this phenomenon, both about the species in the experiment and other animals, Mito said.